what is going on YouTube it's a boy Billy Kibaki and in today's video I'll be explaining what is HFW 4.84.2 hand exploit versus the 4.82 hand exploit and how to use these and what's the difference between them all right I have made this video before but there are people they are still asking the same dumb questions and I'm trying my best to explain it as easy as possible so that they can understand okay so let's start with the first question so what is HFW okay so the HFW is a hybrid firmware that was made from the 4.84 update so what it does it allows the users to install HAN exploit on your non jailbreakable PS3 it can also be done with all PS3 but it's mostly intended for the non jailbreakable PS3 so that those people can have hand exploit running once again on their PS3 non jailbreakable PS3 are super slim and also 3000 slim models those are non jailbreakable PS3 so if you have any one of these PS3 the 3000 slim or the super slim you cannot jailbreak those ps3s your only option is hfw hand exploit second question is can i play online with my hfw exploited ps3 yes you can play online but you will get banned okay i repeat yes you can play online with your hfw exploited ps3 but sony will ban you eventually I don't know how long it takes for Sony to detect you online but once they detect you you will get banned is there any way to unban your HFW no there is no way to unban your HFW third question homebrew hubs so multi-man PSN patch or PSN ninja all these application will not work on HFW hand exploit PS3 these application are for CFW PS3s only so if you install any of them they will not work you will get an error message every time you launch them fourth question yes you can play PS1 PSP and PS2 games with your HFW hand exploited PS3 I've made videos about these so make sure that you guys read through the description and check those videos out fifth question using hand toolbox I've made a video about this before you guys can check that out as well so I'm using the latest version 0.7 so if I press X and enter it we have the offline option soft rebooter offline hand enabler and offline debug enabler we have the hand functions right here these require internet to be on your console so it needs Wi-Fi these up top these are offline so no internet needed so these one up top the three options these are offline no internet needed hand functions internet needed for these options down here we have the local OS hand function this is for PKG linker PKG linker will help you to install large PKGs on your PS3 all the links for this will be in the description read through the description down here we have the external content install package from web server this is for PKG linker cold boot downloader demo downloader front downloader no PSN app theme downloader wallpaper downloader and wave downloader so let me just go ahead and show you guys the wave section wallpaper section themes there's a bunch you can choose from no PSN app what this means is that these application does not require you to be logged in front downloader demo downloader I made a video how to unlock these check the description out call boot downloader and also we have the advanced tools right here and hand toolbox settings as you guys can see version 0.2 seven installing pkg games if you converted a cfw folder game to pkg 
all you have to do is go ahead and install it if you have a PSN game all you have to do is go ahead and just install it on your PS3 no need to sign them when it comes to wrap files you will need to sign that wrap files for the game to work so make sure that you guys keep that in mind okay so let's go over to install then go down to standard here are the files I have on my USB stick I'll be installing the alien breed as you guys can see it does not say signed it doesn't say signed or anything but I'm just gonna install it just as it is so let's wait until it's done okay so the game has finished installing so I'm just gonna go back to package manager and go to the signed wrap pkg file and I'm just gonna explain a few more stuff to you guys right here okay so this is the signed wrap pkg for the game that I just installed alien breed if you do not install the wrap file for whatever game you have you will get a renew license I have made a video how to sign 14,000 wrap files into one pkgs so if you guys want to check that out the link will be in the description also make sure that you enable hand before you try to install any sign pkg as you guys saw i did not enable hand and the pkg would not install so i'll just go ahead now and enable hand press x now let's go back to package manager and let's try and install the signed wrap pkg again and as you guys saw it installed perfectly also keep in mind guys every time you restart your ps3 you need to enable hand first before you try to play the game if you restart your ps3 and you try to play the game you will get an error so i'm going to restart mine and show you guys okay so my ps3 just rebooted remember guys every time you restart your ps3 you need to enable hand first before you can play these games okay so i'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys that i did not enable hand and i'm gonna try and start the game and you're gonna see that i get this error message and there is the error message as you guys saw i did not enable hand so let's go ahead and enable hand now do the offline Now let's go back and try the game now. And there you go. And that's it. As you guys can see, the game launch and everything is working perfectly fine. Um, I hope this helps somebody out. Um, a lot of people keep asking the same question over and over. It seems like nobody wants to watch the video. They just want to ask like dumb questions without watching the video. But um. If the video was helpful to someone please leave a like share the video around and also you guys can subscribe for more video to come all the links will be in the description so make sure that you guys read through the description thank you all for watching and I will see you guys in my next video